Esto es una noche muy importante, ¿no? Creo que para el equipo entero. Eh, eh, ha sido la parte principal, ¿no? Nos hemos preparado para este, para este momento. Y pues nada, estoy listo para hacer mis papeles arriba del ring y nada, ganar mi pelea como es merecido. Un quick touch of the gloves, and these are big men. You can see them both there. They both just stepped over the top rope of the ring rather than step through it. You'll see even bigger men later in Coley the super heavyweights. Coley, Coley, I like it. I just like, I, I like his way. I, got, I could, I'm telling you, this is a beautiful Round fight. one, bring the round. So here we go. Coley in the red. Ooh, guy oh, the big right oh, hand has caught him early. Oh, Referee has stepped in for a standing count there, and he's got to be very careful here on Tacoli. He got caught with a big combination there. Put it over here right. After and walk right back out to fight again. After no time at all, it was in the first 10 seconds really that that landing. Tacoli is still fighting. Knew immediately that what he, he got had. him in trouble. Tacoli, Tacoli is setting himself up to give another right hand, but he did exactly what he came. He's, 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 He's moving in with his head before he throws his hands. See? Coley just begging Akoli to get the gloves on, to get the hands in front of his face. Just looking at Akoli's eyes there. He's not all together right. Not sure if his head is totally clear not yet. yet. If he can make it through this, if he can make it through this, it's not over. He just has to make it out of his mind. He has to survive. Coley's trying to throw that jab by himself a little bit of time, but Savon has got the smell of blood in his nostrils here. Yes. I really, would, I really wish somebody would just tell him to relax. Savon is going to hit him with an overhand right because he's taking a step back. There it is. Well, he's just trying to bob and weave on the ropes and just stumbled a bit as he came forward. I think that was, well, I felt that maybe it was a loss of balance, but actually he's rocked in there and he's in trouble here, Lawrence Coney. Gary Hale, the Jude coach, is right on the apron and he's got the towel in his hand and he's asking him, are you okay? He's taking a seat back again now, though, but it's still a minute 20 left in round one, and the bell seems like a very, very long way away here at the He's moment. A long way home. He can't step straight back. He has to step left or right with Savon. There you go. He has to step left or right with Savon. There you go. Keep your hands up and just. Oh, he's landing shots. He's just, he's just really off right now. He's trying to fight fire with fire in the corner over there to my right. The corner in red. The line is just shaking their head. I feel he's taking huge risks Savone, here. Savon, Savon is like a shark. He walked out, assessed what he had, and he is bombing now. Well, as soon as he threw that first left hand after, what, 10 seconds? He heard it to Cody. There was blood in the water. Yes, it was. There was blood in the water. And, he, and, and, he's, look, for him ever and since. he's looking to hit him with the left hook, right over, to, over the hand. Right over the hand. Oh, oh! Well, I think that was more... Uh, an arm that just knocks Savon off balance there, but still takes some encouragement. Coley has a, Coley has a, Coley's, Coley's left hand is, is, is in a strange place. And Stop. he's going to get, he's going to hit with a right hand right about now. He got caught there right again. Now. He was just a quick open of Coley. He went over cut. He to the inside. He went cut. The referee with another standing count. And he's on the apron again here, the GB coach. It's right at the end of the round. So maybe they'll just give him that minute between rounds. Fraser Clark to our right on his feet. I think he feels that he's seen enough, maybe. That was very, very, very tough.